To surprise this exceptional teacher is an actress who has one of the most sought-after jobs in television. She gets to snog Doctor Who. <laughs> it's Alex Kingston. Hello. I'm at Southern Banks Primary School here in Gloucestershire, and I'm about to present this to new teacher Rachel Keeble. Now, they're all in assembly at the moment, and they don't know I'm here, so I have to keep a low profile. So before I surprise her with this, I want you to take a look at what makes her so outstanding. With newly qualified teachers, you do expect them to sort of take their first year to actually settle in. Rachel just flew right from the start. We used to be the worst class in the school in year three. Now she's made us like the best ever. One of the special things about Rachel is she's really, really good at finding out what the children are interested in and somehow incorporate that into her lessons. Right, guys, so your Doctor Who challenge today, hopefully... Occasionally, we get a visit from Doctor Who, who sets us some tricky challenges, which we then have to solve. Fantastic, brilliant. The children enjoy Rachel's lessons because they're learning, but they don't feel like they're learning. You need to decide quickly what you have discovered today. Back to your tables quickly. Everyone in this class loves... Doctor Who, and we don't care about like if the lessons are hard or easy, we just focus on helping Doctor Who. Victoria is able to um, retain the information due to enjoying the class. We use the news to try and think about what's going on in the world around us. Hello and welcome to the BBC News. And then in turn, we then use what we're learning about in class and translate it into news shows. I'm with Doctor James for you and and he's going to which helps the children to put what they're thinking about and what they've learnt about into a different context. Well done, guys. That was amazing. Give them a big round of applause. Absolutely fabulous. Never in my wildest dreams did I think that Shakespeare would be taught at Key Stage 2 in Seven Banks School. You must go and move like part of time. In Drama Club, we're currently working on um, an abridged version of A Midsummer Night's Dream, and the children are absolutely loving it. They've actually performed it recently in a real theatre to an audience of 350 people. I only did that because I knew Miss Keeble would like, help me get through it, because stage fright is like my worst fear. So, and I was crying after I did it, because Miss Keeble actually made me like, overcome my fear best way to engage a child is to also have their parents on board. Tea parties are a really great opportunity for the parents to come in and to engage with their children's learning. Miss Keeble gives parents the motivation to help with our children's learning and to help them to succeed. When you talk to every child about Miss Keeble and about how they feel about her teaching, their face lights up. To prepare your mind for the challenge. She has an aura which sparkles. Whatever it is, she's got it. Sorry! Yeah! I absolutely love teaching. Um, it doesn't feel like a job at all because work shouldn't be this much fun. Right, everyone's in there, so uh, it's the moment of truth. Let's go. Oh, hello, everybody. I'm so sorry to interrupt. I've just stepped off the TARDIS to present this very special award to somebody in this room. Wow. Rachel Keeble, I present this award to you, and you are the outstanding new teacher of the year. <laughs> Thank you so much, everybody, um, all the staff, everybody, um, but most importantly, my wonderful class. The winner of the Outstanding New Teacher of the Year, Rachel Keeble from Seven Banks Primary School. And now to the final award of the evening, the Ted Rag Lifetime Achievement Award, which recognises the overwhelming dedication a teacher has given throughout their professional career. To present this award is one of Britain's cultural icons, a master of his craft for over 30 years, whether it's a popular musical or a Shakespearean tragedy. His productions are renowned throughout the world. 
Please welcome Sir Trevor Nunn.